I'm so glad you answered. Sophia had her precious feelings hurt because I said a bad word. You better send the wambulance right away. Wait, listen, I hear it coming. Wham! Be quiet, Tyler. I'm serious. Or what? You'll arrest me? You're such a baby, Sophia. Refusing to boogie with Granny? That means something is really wrong. What happened? Sophia kindly asked a boy on the bus to stop cursing, and instead of stopping, he took it to the next level and then made fun of her. Ay. But I told him to be quiet, and he stopped. He didn't stop. The bus drove off. Minor detail. I'm sure he likes teasing you because you can't help but react. No, I don't. Oh, yeah? I get the computer first for homework. What? No! I called it! See? Awesome reaction. Later. Ugh. You're very brave, telling that boy how his language made you feel. I always want to stand up for what I feel is right. But when I did, it only seemed to make it worse. I think it wouldn't have mattered who told that boy to be quiet. He probably wouldn't have stopped. It's just that it hurts my heart when I hear words like that. I can totally feel the spirit go away. Mmm, that makes life a little better. <laughs> Give it a half an hour and it'll be ready. Now, it's obvious you cannot control that boy, but what can you control? Nothing. Really? Nothing? Nothing. Take a break. You can argue with me. Wait, what did you say? I didn't hear you. I said you can argue with that boy or find other ways to deal with the problem. I'm sure Heavenly Father would help you figure out different solutions. If you ask him, Sophia, did your insurance cover the cost of the ambulance? You know, you inspired me yesterday. So, last night I looked up some other spicy words that might interest you. We can thank the internet. Ooh, let's start with this one. Ever heard of the word? <laughs> okay, well, how about this one? No, don't pretend like you can't hear what I'm saying.
want to listen? <laughs>